New details this morning about that suspect that went on a stabbing spree in Paris, killed one, injured four others, and apparently he was on a police radar uh, placed on an anti-terror watch list. He was suspected of having radicalized views and did pose a security threat, we're learning. CNN international correspondent Melissa Bell is in Paris with more details. Melissa, what else are you learning about this suspect? Well, that he was very young, Christy. This is a man who was born in 1997 in Chechnya. He had become a French citizen, and we're hoping to learn more over the course of the day since his mother and father are now in police custody. But other than that, details about how he became radicalized, when he became radicalized, exactly what he was hoping to achieve when he set out on the streets of Paris with that knife last night, those uh, remain the subject of speculation this morning. Now, this is exactly where it happened yesterday evening. This would have been a bustling part of Paris on a Saturday night night. It happened just before 9 p.m. We spoke to one man who saw exactly what happened. I, I saw the attacker come just down this street here with blood on his hands, carrying the cutter and uh, with his arms open, gesturing to the three policemen who were here. And uh, they managed to sort of encircle him. They tasered him several times to, I think, missed him. Um, he managed to isolate one of the policemen and, and, and moved down the street. And as he went in, with the, went in, the policeman shot twice and, and he fell. You can imagine the shock, and you heard it in that man's voice just then, Christy, of the people who would have been around here last night witnessing as they did a stabbing since one man has died, four others were injured, and we're hearing that one of those who was most grievously injured will in fact recover from his injuries.